this is Animat, and welcome back to the Muppet Vlog. Now this time we're going to be looking into the second episode of Season 5 of The Muppet Show, which features Loretta Swit. Now for those of you who don't know who Loretta Swit is, she is actually a character actress of stage and television. Where when she would perform on stage, she would appear in such plays as The Odd Couple, Amorous Crossings, and also The Vagina Monologues. But her most famous role that she is very well known for would have to be playing as Major Margaret Hot Lips Hulian from the series MASH, in which she actually won two Emmy Awards for. Now, going into the episode that she appeared in, holy crap! It is probably the best way to describe it, it's intense. Like, I just watched it and like... Oh my god, it's like so weird to watch, honestly. And it doesn't really have to do with uh, the weirdness that the Muppets would deliver or like the style of humor that they would bring out. But honestly, it has to be Kermit because I can guarantee you guys there will never be an episode or probably anything that you could find where Kermit is this pissed off where Kermit just completely blew his lid and is absolutely raging. Now, the thing is, the plot of this story, in this episode in particular, would be that Miss Piggy would go and spread a rumor in a gossip magazine that apparently her and Kermit are married. Now, I know this is not the first time that it ever happened. Like, there are a few episodes where Miss Piggy is trying to convince people that her and Kermit are actually married. But this time around, Kermit has had enough. He's having none of it this time. He is so pissed off to the point that he legitimately fired Miss Piggy. Pretty much like kicking her out completely. And there are a few of the, st uh, of the stuff that uh, Miss Piggy would appear in, like sketches from Veterinarian's Hospital and also Pigs in Space, but he decided to go replace her with Loretta Lynn, uh, Loretta Swift, sorry, not Loretta Lynn. So Miss Piggy, uh, she's pretty much having a bit of a hard time trying to cooperate with this whole situation. Like, you know, at first, like, she is a bit sad and, uh, like, she's mostly feeling the same way as she would going through a breakup where yeah, it is a bit heartbreaking that she has to leave, but then she's more happy that she's leaving because she doesn't have to see Kermit, but then afterwards, when she realized that Loretta Swit is replacing Miss Piggy altogether, she decided that she wants to ultimately stay and try to kick out Loretta Swit and all that kind of stuff. But still, like, throughout the entire episode, except at the very end, like, Kermit is just so mad. Like, you can feel the steam coming off of him like it's just crazy and it's kind of a side that you have never seen from Kermit and you might not ever will like this is one of those episodes where you look at the criticisms from the 2015 Muppet series and like this episode just proves them wrong altogether like yeah, you want to see Kermit mean-spirited and all that stuff? You watch this episode because, my god, you will never see Kermit this much of a total, like, uh, in total rage mode like this. Like, holy crap. Uh, but uh, going back into some of the stuff in the episode, like, there are a few, there are some really good numbers here. Like, uh, the opening number called Ain't Nobody Here But Us Chickens is actually really funny and really great. Like, uh, one of those standalone Muppet numbers where it's really a lot of fun to watch, it has great humor, and uh, a nice musical number on top of that. So, it's definitely all good, definitely a lot of fun to watch. Uh, and then there's another one called I Feel the Earth Move, where she would perform with Thog. Now, if you guys know Thog, he's like the big blue Muppet that's like, Probably, from what I've heard, it's like between 7 to 9 feet tall. But in here, they made him as a legit giant, where he's like probably 120 feet tall. Where, like, you see Thog on this set with like miniature houses and stuff like that, and he's just destroying everything in his path. And there's even an attempt of a special effect where he's trying to pick up Loretta Swit, uh, pretty much trying to sing 
uh, the song, uh, what, what was it again? Yeah, I Feel the Earth Move. Like, it is debatable, like, if it's a good job on that editing. It's something they haven't done before, but still, like, it is pretty crazy. You know, it's actually pretty cool to see. And, uh, there are a few other ones, uh, like, uh, what was another one? Oh, yeah, when Miss Piggy would sing, uh, Some of These Days. That's pretty much her transition from feeling sad that she's leaving the show uh, up to when she's happy to leave the show. Like, that's actually a pretty good number there. And then suddenly, at the end, when everything is resolved, uh, like, everybody would just sing, with Loretta Swit as well, side by side, and what would we do without you? So that's pretty much the one big thing to have Kermit and Miss Piggy reconnect and, uh, you know, have Loretta Swit save the day and all that kind of stuff. But, yeah, that's basically the whole gist of this episode, is that you do have a good... Uh, like a good few numbers on the side that does provide some good entertainment but the whole thing is like holy crap it is so intense it's mostly seeing a side of Kermit that you haven't seen before that you see him so enraged about Miss Piggy's usual shenanigans and like you you pretty much see Kermit at his tipping point uh, yeah at his uh, tipping point that he cannot stand it anymore he is just full-on mad and it's like it's just so weird to watch so yeah that's the one thing i could say overall is that it's just so weird admittedly uh a lot of the stuff in the episode is definitely great uh great musical numbers uh loretta swit is actually a really good guest star sings well is actually pretty funny y you know she actually does her job very well in this episode but it's the factor of seeing kermit so freaking mad at miss piggy it's like, it's honestly, I, I, I just don't know how to explain it. It's a side of Kermit that we have never seen before. It's like, it's pretty much kind of the opposite of how you would normally see Kermit. But seeing him like this at his, t you know, uh, seeing him go absolutely ballistic is almost unheard of. So yeah, this is honestly just a weird episode that's just hard to describe. I mean... If you want to see Kermit completely enraged, then this is the episode for you, I guess. But anyways, that's pretty much it with this episode of The Muppet Vlog. So I just want to say thank you guys so much for watching. And hopefully Kermit will cool down for the next episode. But we will only know until next time. So, see you later, dudes.